Hey y'all, so today I just want to do some makeup and chill. So today, I don't know what I'm doing. I poured myself a glass of wine. So yeah, that's pink Moscato. I don't know the brand. Got it out of Kroger's. Y'all already know. So, let's do a little chatting. Top of my brows, it's in my favorite Revlon Color Stay Brow Crayon. This is absolutely my favorite. Um, when I go back into Walmart, I'm gonna get me another one. Another one based to this. Yeah, Target has 20% off of Revlon products. That's where I normally buy these. I love these brow products. Concealer, I know this eyebrows look very bad, but it's all right. A little concealer on the back of my hand. This is the NYX concealer. Yeah. So, if you're a mother, how do you feel about those babies being in school right now? Like, how do you feel? This is my first year of school. This is my daughter's first year of kindergarten. And I like it, but I don't like it. I'm one of those very super overprotective mommies. Like, some people tell me that I need to chill out with it. But I don't know how I did it. I don't know. Okay, this is the best thing I'm going to get with these brows. And that is the NYX concealer as well. And I'm just gonna pat this into my eyeball. Y'all, I have a new video up. If you have not watched it yet, I am doing a voiceover. And I have not done a voiceover in so freaking long. But anyway, I'm going into the magic palettes. Um, every day I have an eyeshadow palette on my vanity. So next time I record, this is just like what I go to. Even if I've used the palette before, obviously it's something in my mind. My mind tells me, change the palette out, change the palette out. You know? So, yeah. And I know I've been killing these palettes. I really have. Like, my last three or four tutorial girls have been with solely these palettes. And if you don't mind, then, you know, I love you. If you do mind, um, uh, sorry. I just want to play with these palettes for a little while. So, yeah. Okay. I know I said I was going to go and uh, look and see what makeup looks have not been done. But, no one person is the same. So, actually have not looked to see what makeup looks have not been done. <laughs> yeah. Today, I'm just doing makeup. And I'm using the color... Kiss, 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 That's the color I'm using. Yep. And yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna be very, very honest with y'all. I don't even know how this makeup is gonna turn out because when I drink wine, I get so relaxed, and it's just like I feel like I move. Whew, I feel like I move. <laughs> I feel like I move so slow. So let's see how this is gonna work out. Cause I think I have, I think I got something in my mind that I wanna do, but I'm not sure. So I'm gonna start with Nana, which is the brown color. Which is the brown color in the palette? I think I put too much. I always do. And I just want to blend this for a little while. Like, when I say blend, I blend. Like, I want to make this, uh, not the staple color, but I want this to be the color that peeked through the other colors. I wish this green Ajaya, I wish it wasn't so dark. I don't know. I'm going to use this, uh, blue. Let's see what this blue do. This blue is a color that I cannot pronounce. And I'm just going to take that blue to the outer. I wish I had my tape. 
hard. I'll pack it right here. And I am going to take it up a little bit, like up into the crease way, just a little. I don't think I did a blue eye before, or have I? I think I did a one year a Christmas eye, and it was like blue and gold. I don't know if I can see what kind of glitter I got. Oh, pigment, a pigment, a pigment. And it's uh, Violet Colors. These are some of my favorite glitters. This is in the color Twinkle. And it's green. Let me swatch it. No, I might not need to swatch it. Uh, look, it's green. It's green. And I might add a little gold to it. I have a gold one. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to mix these two. I'm going to mix Twinkle with Glowing. Glowing is one of my favorites. It's the prettiest one of them all. I'm just gonna take the L'Oreal True Match and I might use this today on my face. I haven't used it in a while. It is one of my favorite concealers. It just costs too damn much. Like this little bit of tube costing ten dollars. Like betrayer. Okay. I even like brush sets. I never throw these away because it's like you always have uses for them. And if you freelance, it's like something you can do with almost anything. So I'm just gonna take it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I am like, girl, is you covering up all that work? I'm just gonna take it to about right where I put the green. So. My camera died, but I did want to ask you I kind of like get the vibe of it. And this is how it's going to look with that gold and that green together. I don't know why I didn't apply a glitter adhesive to my eye. I don't know. But I'm not going to add it to this eye either. I just thought about it. <laughs> um... So yeah, what I did was I went and put a little more blues in my crease. Like right here and like right along here. And I did some more extra stuff as you see. A bunch of see that when we get there. Just a little more. And the name of the game is blending. Start blending this way, then that way, blend, 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 blend. Just taking my little concoction, my little glitter concoction, and I sprayed it with some e.l.f. Uh, mix and fix, mist and set. Why do I always say mix? Mist and fix is mist and set. And I wasn't getting my house. Lord Jesus, but I'm waiting on you, Lord. Yeah, I'm just plathering this on my eyeball. I don't know why it looks brighter on this eye. Maybe because it's more gold. Now I'm gonna take this smaller blending brush that has all those colors on it, y'all. Just kind of like blend it out and around and about. This look came out to be like smoky. Now I didn't try. I was gonna sit down and do some good girl makeup, like. Um, everyday makeup, but <sighs> that didn't happen. That didn't happen. Oh, I'm going to take these lashes by who is this by Flutter and the uh, style rock sand and some liquid liner and come back to the face. Okay. Oh, I'm not finishing my eye yet. I'm not finishing my eye. So. Next, I'm going to take a oh, Zakia right here. And I did something when I made it like blown out right here. And then I just took the Bling Girl Bling Girl brush. And I think I put so much product right there though. But now I just blended it out so it can be really pretty. And then I went back into my initial blending color. I'm never drinking again and trying to do wing liner. Look how big this wing is. Uh, so, I'm just going to take Nana and like blend those two colors together. Alright, now see. On the 
So let's start working on his face. I'm tired of his ass. And I took the long. This is the longest I've ever took to do some eyeshadow. I haven't used this primer in a while. I missed by. Um, oh, what is this? Ooh. This is by Sunbrand. I can't think off the top of my head. It's uh, Shop and Say. It's by Shop and Say. It's their own line. Because you know, they sell everybody else's stuff. And then I guess they thought, like, we sell everything else for $4. Let's make our own brand. Let's use the same manufacturers and get us a little something, something started too. Because I said I'm using my L'Oreal concealer today, I might as well use my L'Oreal foundation, which is W7, uh, Karma Beige. This is one of my favorite. It's drugstore. But matter of fact, this is my favorite drugstore. The one that's the least expensive. I also like Circa Beauty, but it's really just on the sole at Walgreens. And it's only at Select Walgreens. So that's why I never say this is my favorite, but it's actually one of my favorites. So I'm just going to blend this into my face. How beautiful this looks. And how beautiful it's sitting into the skin. I have a beauty blender or no beauty blender. It's just so beautiful. Can't go without cream contour. I just, I just can't. Um, I'm gonna use the color almond to cream contour. And in, in, in the tube is dark, but like on my face, it's not that dark. I don't know. I don't know why, but this tube is like super dark. But when I put it on my face, maybe it's not a good contour shade. I'm just gonna blend it out though. When I blend it out, it give me like, it give me a nice color. It give me a nice uh, contour. So I don't know what it is. Is it just like the undertone of it? Not so much the color, but the undertone is bomb. I use my Laura Mercier. And this is worth the hype. It is worth the money if you um are looking to splurge on an item it's worth it but you have to know how to use these products a lot of beauty influencers um abuse products and then don't like them they don't like them because they're not using them correctly so i'm taking the smallest amount of powder taping out the excess and going down the bridge of my nose there's left in my little cap because I put some in the cap, I take it with like a big old brush like this. Big old brush. And like press it into my skin. Just to sit the rest of my face. I am going to contour my face. Contour bronze or whatever. And this right here just bring the warmth back from their translucent powder. The old Kita from the bottom of the map back. I'm starting back to uh, double bronze with two products. And now back in the day, being like in my earlier YouTube career, I used to do it. I used to double bronze all the time. I think I still do, but like I love the way the double bronze look. It's just like a shadow and a shadow sister. Like it help you bleed out the first color. My bottom lash line. Um, I'm just gonna take Zakia and put that at the bottom because I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I'm gonna take this color. I don't wanna make the um uh, bottom too closed off. So I just wanna take some Zakia. I'm gonna spray my face. Y'all already know that with the uh glow mist. So I finally found one, the Maybelline Master Chrome. I found one once before. I just I didn't buy it being and then when I went in the store, this one was good zone. So so pretty. I'm just gonna run run my brush on it. And my face still a little dim. That look pretty. That look really pretty. That little gorilla part. It actually reminds me of you got the texture of the Lord Geller. It has the texture of the Lord Gillard. I like. 
Okay, nose. No, so good. Putting on. Okay, so I'm taking Willow by Wedding Wow and Money my lips. Milani lipstick in Matte Beauty. Hey, I did. I like it. I like it a whole lot. Hope you guys like it. We are done with the wine. Not something that you probably wear. Do while you, you know, drinking. So I just add a little gloss. And if you like this look, now let me know. I thought it was the end, but I had to add some gloss to it. It's just the glossy lips are just, mm, I don't know, just something about a juicy lip that I've just been loving lately. So if you guys like this look, thumbs up this video. And if you guys just like getting, like, just makeup and chilling, this is so freaking fun to me. Like, I feel good once a week. Let me know down below in the comments, like, what day, what date should I do it on Saturdays, Mondays? Like, we need to make this a weekly video. Even if it's not, I'm not drinking wine, but just more of a chill, do makeup kind of video because we never know what we're going to come up with. Never know. And, like, leave some topics down below that y'all want to talk about. Too. I love you guys. <laughs> Until next time. Bye.